Hi guys, welcome. This is Aqua Aura 111 Tarot. And I am back. I am back. And this reading is going to be for the sign of Capricorn because it is the Capricorn season right now. And by the way, happy belated, happy Christmas. Merry Christmas to all of you guys, belated. And happy new year, right? So I just needed to take a break, okay? To recharge my batteries as a light worker i mean sometimes we do need to recharge our batteries and take a break so i needed to do that and i am back now transformation for you guys okay so this um video i'm doing here is for the year okay of 2022 so what to expect for you guys in the year of 22 and this year of 22, let me tell you guys, is going to be a year of transformation, uh, realization, awakening. If you're not awakened yet to your person, it will be the time, okay? Communicating freely. Wow. Um, I communicate from the depths of my being. Okay? So, um... Someone here is transforming and this is this transformation is going to help them communicate, open that throat chakra. Okay, this is something going freely. You see the the winds here coming out of their mouth. You see that this blow of a um, burst of energy. I do feel I fear of burst of energy. So this is transformation. And during this process. They also, maybe there is some blockage with their throat chakra that is going to be uh, unlocked here in order to communicate something to you, okay? Let's see. <clears throat> yeah, we had at the bottom of the deck, we have renewing your life. So this is also about this transformation here happening, up, happening for you guys, uh, Capricorn. So it could also be anything in any kind of um it doesn't have to be only only love, okay? It can be any anything, beauty. Okay, some of you are working on yourself here, okay? Um you someone is looking at the mirror. I feel like someone also is spying on you. Okay. Yeah, there is again I see this transformation here. You see this person here, it looks like it's half mermaid and half um, human. So there is this transformation. You There is a, a realization here, okay, that is you are more than a human. You are a spiritual being too, okay? You, you're coming from another star seed. Uh, you're coming from a star, star seed family as well. And there is this realization here. You're looking at the mirror and you're looking at yourself, your, your, your true self, right? This is also the transformation here for you. Prosperity. You're going to walk into prosperity, okay? Wow. Okay, let's look with the tarot. Let's look a little bit more in details. What is 2022 is going to bring to my Capricorn, please? And by the way, Capricorn, happy birthday, okay? Happy, happy birthday. I wish you all the best for this new year. And hopefully it will be a year of prosperity, of walking each other home, and of finding uh, our divine counterpart. And also, of course, health, you know, for everybody. Ooh, two of wands. There's a little bit of waiting here, okay? Oh, you've been waiting for that. Ooh, look at this. Okay. All right. Right out of the bat here, we have the six of, um, the six, the, no, the card number six, the lovers, not the six of ones. <laughs> I was going to say the six of one, but it's the lovers. Okay. So um, you could be dealing with a Gemini here. And there is a little bit of a choice here as well. Someone here has to, um, has to go through a transformation here and uh, see something differently okay the two of wands is someone who is blindfolded here you see this person is wearing a blindfold and i did hear crows just now when i started your reading capricorn and i think it's very significant to you for you with the crows energy you could have a um 
um, you could be connecting with the crow um, uh, spirit animal, okay? But the crow here is trying to unhook you from something, entangled you here, I feel, okay? They are letting go, they're helping you let go of this blindfold that you're holding for too long. And uh, there's a choice here that has to be done, okay? There's communication here, two of swords is blocked. Communication has, has been blocked for a while, and now it's finally opening up. And communication about love, for sure, because we have uh, the Page of Cups here. So this is a friend, maybe, that you know, someone that you know, that is coming and offering you this love. But they're letting you the choice, okay? They're letting you this um, free will. This is your call. This is your decision, I hear, okay? Seven of Pentacles. This is, again, this waiting energy that I have here. Seven of Pentacles is someone who planted the seeds and is waiting patiently for it to grow, okay? So I do feel this person is not... Uh, someone here is not going to wait... Um, they're not waiting and they're not going to uh, they're not going to see this coming, okay? Because they've been waiting, maybe they've been busy um, working on something, okay? Someone here could be you, could be your person, Capricorn. But someone is busy here working on something and they don't see this coming. And you see the pig here, it's when pigs fly fly, okay? You don't see this coming. Alright? Because you're blindfolded. But there's someone here who has a lot of love for you. This is someone who see you has their counterpart here. This is a deep connection. A divine connection. Okay. This is also uh, a transformation for someone here. Someone who has changed their mind about something. Seeing things differently. Um, work on themselves. Probably their throat chakra. To be... Um, to be strong enough to communicate this love to you, okay? This what they have to say to you. They see you as beautiful. Someone here sees someone else as beautiful, as transformed. Yeah, they're not going to recognize this person, and uh, they're not gonna. You're not gonna see that coming. See it coming either. Um, let me pull some oracle on this. All right, what is this about? Ooh. Those cards, I swear, they're like they're flying right now. Okay, we have number three, um, mm -hmm. Mary, marriage. We have number twenty-two, official person, and we have courthouse twenty-three, but came in reverse. You see, I don't know if you saw how it fell on my table, but it came in reverse. So I'm gonna take it in reverse. I do feel someone coming out of the marriage for some of you guys, okay? But it is someone who has working on some contracts, you know. Could be marriage contracts, uh, ending ma uh, contracts, marriage contracts, or uh, working on their business here. Because I do feel see official person, could be some someone a military person, a boss person. Okay, so now they're coming. What they're gonna do? They're gonna court you. Okay, this is also the page of um, uh, cups that I have here. This person is going to court you here, for sure. And what they want here is marriage because you've been married. You've been in this contract spiritually already. This is a spiritual uh, connection here, okay? With the lo uh, lovers and the, the marriage card here. This is a spiritual connection that you both share. And they finally open up your eyes, their eyes, and maybe yours. And um, they finally so realize this, okay? I'm going to fly or clarify with my mini deck. Okay, yeah, I hear again, this person wants to court you. They definitely wants to court you. They want to get to know you, okay? They really do. But what they want more, most of all, is like they... they, they they want to get married with you. They want to have a family with you. Look at that. Two of cups. See, I don't lie. Cards don't lie. Look at that. Four of swords. Yeah, they've been... Uh, look at that. We have the six of cups as well. Yeah, definitely this person has been very patient, okay? This person is, has been very patient and they were healing too. They were transforming. There was a transformation too in this process, okay? And they've been very patient as well. 
I'm going to show you the cards because they're very mini. They're very tiny. I think they're so cute. Okay. So there we go. So we have the two of cups. We have the four of swords and we have the six of cups right here. So definitely this is again a soul contract. You've been married. You you know this person before. If it's not from this life, it's you've been meeting every lifetime. You've been meeting this person. They know you. You feel this... You feel this pull towards them. You, you, they feel this pull towards you. If you don't know them yet, you will. Once you meet them, you will feel this pull towards each other. Okay? Okay, what else for my Capricorns? What else for my Capricorn? Oof, wait here. Uh, yep, just being near you is intoxicating. Okay, so I do I do feel like one of one of them they might be looking at you, they might be spying at you, they might know you at some some level. Okay, they might know you, and this is what they're telling you. They also saying that I remember every detail of that day. Okay, so maybe there was the day they met you. Okay, it will it will not resonate with all of you. If it's not, if you don't know this person, if you don't know who I'm talking about, then it's not for you. Or maybe it will be for you in, you know, it's for a, it's a yearly, um, it's a yearly reading. Okay, so uh, there we go. And they saying I love you. Right, they saying I love you. I do feel here actually it's gonna be for the month of January. Yeah. Because I didn't take it general enough to have a yearly reading here, so I will make it for January. But it could happen anytime in the year because my intention was to do a, a yearly reading, but it could be any time at this from this time to the next year, okay? Yeah, this person deeply love you. They do. All right, uh, what else can I pull for you guys? Let me see. Um, do I have my decks nearby? Hold on, guys. I'm going to get one deck here. Hmm. Okay, let's see what your... Um, what the angels want to tell you if you have a question it is the time to ask the angels i grab the angel answers so just uh, ask the question you want anything you want at this time what does it need to know one final answer for my Capricorn. the situation will improve that's one thing one more Improving health. Okay. Within the next few weeks. At the bottom of the deck. So, um, yeah, so definitely here, uh, something is improving here. Success behind us. Improving health and situation will improve. Wow, guys. Okay, that's beautiful. So, yeah, there is someone here, like a strong counterpart, a strong... Uh, Connection here, someone who is coming into your life, okay, in the next few weeks, like it says here. And this person will want to court you, okay? Definitely, there is some uh, good intention behind that. They want they want marriage, they want commitment with you, okay? All right, guys, I hope that you enjoyed. Please like, share, and uh, like, share, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.